What's up, everybody? Welcome to the 21st day of the Squad Builder Show and Advent Calendar, where our journey of pain continues. Today, we have got 1.1 million coin team of the group stage, Jude Bellingham, and we are joined by another absolute wizard at this game, Mr. AA9 Skills. How are you, mate? I'm good. A wiz I just want to say really quickly that the last two years we've done this together, the first year I cheated, the second year you cheated. So I'm excited to see who <laughs> cheats this year. I am excited, bro. That is why we're doing it so close to Christmas, mate. Santa hasn't got time to change his lists around. Mm. We're stuck on the good list forever this year. Let's go. No naughty list for us, bud. Have you seen? Did you know Santa is a Sith Lord? Stop. You know, I just watched the Star Wars series about two weeks ago with my wife. We sat down, we watched the whole thing, and I can't believe it took me that long to watch it. Really? I just done the same thing, except it was like two months ago instead of a couple of weeks ago. Me and Katie just watched it for the first time. Same. So maybe mine was like, we started, we probably started watching it two months ago. It was around Halloween. Yeah, yeah. Dude, crazy. That we started funny. watching it too. It's in, it's incredible. They're so good. Yeah. So I'd actually seen the new trilogy. The okay. one with Ray. With oh, I can never remember his name. He's such a good actor, the guy who plays Kylo Ren. Oh, I'm I'm bad I'm bad with, with names, but he was really good. Yeah, and he's in like the Gucci or Versace mm -hmm. or whatever film is of Lady Gaga and stuff. Anyway, I've seen them ones because I was really lucky and got invited to the world premiere wow. of the second one of them films in the Royal Abbey Hall. So the night before, we were like, oh my God, I've never seen Star Wars, but this is so cool, I can't not go. And then watched the first one, and we was like, oh, this is really good. And then we went to the second one, and it was okay, but a bit annoying because we had to be in there two hours before uh -huh. and just sit there and wait for the royal family to get there, which is a big old faff. And the film was all right. Very cool experience, though. And in the th Have you seen this one? The third one of the sequels? Yeah, I've seen all of them. No bueno, no bueno. See, I'm going to be honest with you, bro. I watched all of it from beginning to end, and I like the new ones. I actually might like the new ones more than the old ones, and that's a hot take that people will never agree that with me on. That is gonna get you canceled, I know, bro. Yeah, oh my I know. god! No, no, the old ones are incredible. I just, I'm someone who's really like into like graphics and stuff, and I just like the new ones are just so visually like pleasing. The story is so much better in the old ones, but the, it's it's so visual pleasing just watching like the new. Sure. Like I don't know, I don't know if that makes okay. sense. Yeah, yeah, I'm with you. From the original the original trilogy, I would say, this, see, this is probably going to get me some hate, is objectively terrible. Like, the stories written by George Lucas, who isn't very good at writing, the CGI, it doesn't exist. It's just yeah. Han Solo on a toy horse. Yeah. <laughs> and the acting from some of them is absolutely awful as hell. The only person who can act in the first Star Wars film is Carrie Fisher. However, the prequel ones are really good and the CGI is actually quite good then. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I think the new one's just visual pleasing. My favorite Star Wars out of all of it. There is a correct answer. Oh, to what? Go on. No, tell me what you tell, tell Well, me what it's you... not even part of it. I like the Han Solo movie. Okay, I've, I haven't watched that yet. Oh, it's incredible. I, that movie's so good. The 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 visual looks good, the acting's good, everything, man. The, the Han Solo movie's sick. I thought it was amazing. So the correct answer for the best Star Wars is Revenge of the Sith, just so you know. Is that number two? Is that the number two of the first ones or number three? No, that's the third one of the prequel trilogy. So that's the one where the graphics are kind of good and it's about okay. young Anakin. Yeah yeah, 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 yeah. I like that one a lot. That's a great movie. That's a great movie. Yeah, that one is the correct answer. If you if you say the wrong answer, Trekkies will kill you. Really? Mm. <laughs> Yeah, but any, you real quick, you're not real quick. To, favorite character, favorite character, mine's Chewbacca. Favorite character? Chewbacca, yo, he's amazing. Obi-Wan. Okay, that's a good answer, good answer. Well done, well done. All right. Hello there. I like that, I like that. For democracy. So good, so good. There's people posting their favorite characters in the chat, and I'm pretty sure they're just trolling, because someone's just said Padme, who has the least depth of any character I've ever seen in a film ever. <laughs> Like, there's just this stupid little angsty teen boy, and then she's like insanely hot and like queen of a country, and then suddenly just goes, I love you. What's she doing? Let's get a grip. But that is just George Lucas's inability to write good dialogue mm. and a love story. And then someone else has put Jar Jar Binks, who might quite possibly be the most irritating character I've ever seen in a film franchise, anyway. Ever. Just period. Hard agree. I hard agree right there. Oh my god. But yeah, so oh, I know why we got into this. Santa is a Sith Lord. Okay. Because it's not you're on the naughty list or the nice list, and only Sith steal in absolutes. 
you come up with that yourself? Absolutely not seen it on Instagram. <laughs> Anyway, anyway, enough about the naughty list, enough about cheating. We're okay. not going on the naughty list because it's too late. Santa can't change. And actually, in between Boxing Day and New Year, you've got like free reign to do whatever you want as well because I reckon Santa doesn't start his naughty list until next year. Uh-huh. Because it's, it's not that, it's not whether you're good that year, isn't it? But like December to December 31st, Boxing Day to December 31st, that's still this year. But it doesn't count for Christmas because it's been. It, it, it's kind of like the Ballon d'Or. You actually don't know when they start counting the votes and like when it actually, you just, Ooh. you know what I'm saying? You never really know yeah, when it starts yeah. and when it doesn't start. Everybody has different answers. I guess Santa, Santa moves like that. I do know one thing. Jude Bellingham's going to win it one day. I, he's amazing. He's amazing. He is unbelievable. He's so good. His card comes out as a center attack in mid and he's got intercept plus, which is a defensive play style. The lad can do it all. Just does it all. He does it all. What can he not do? Absolutely outrageous. And he's born in... Huh? If I could press R3. 2003. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the uh, skills were so old. Nah, I was born two years uh, uh, before him, bro. Two years before? <laughs> I don't even know how old that would make you. Two decades before. <laughs> Yo, champ! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. Oh. <laughs> right. Shall we jump in and start doing some Scrubble Showdown before we sit here and talk about Star Wars all day and we end up with a two-hour video and my comment section crucifies me? We actually should. What formation would you like to play your Bellingham in, mate? Are we guessing already? Yep. What wait, formation wait, I have do to... you want? Hold on, hold on. I got it right. Yo, my marker's not working good, bro. It's not... Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me write yours down, okay? All right. Okay. Okay. I'll have a, I'll have a sip of coffee and calm down. So, okay. okay, okay, okay. You can kind of see it. All right, it works. I would like to play Jude Bellingham in a 4 2 4. Wow. Okay. I love how you call him Bellingham. Jude Bellingham. And you? <laughs> I'm going to go off on one again. Just reminds me of there's a Scottish comedian uh -huh. who makes like skits of going to. He got, pretending to be in Scotland as an American tourist and then does it with his mate who does like the angry Scottish reaction to it. Uh, uh -huh. You've just reminded me of that because Birmingham obviously isn't in Scotland, but that's what American people call Birmingham. And mm. then what's the capital of Scotland skills? Oh no, don't don't do this to me. Uh it's got a castle. Yeah, it's not it's not Glasgow. Because that's where Rangers and Celtic are from. Oh, don't do this to me, bro. I, you're going to make me look... Uh, first of all, you got, I'm going to get in trouble for my Star Wars comment, and now I'm going to get in trouble for this. Just tell me. <laughs> but I don't want to tell you, because then I'll, that would make me... That will tell you how to say it. You know, when you say castle, all I want to say is Newcastle. That's clearly not it. Uh, okay, clearly... Yeah, that's by Scotland, to be fair. Okay, Newcastle. Okay, it starts with an E and then a D. I have no idea. I wish I did. I'm trying to get you to say Edinburgh. Oh, for the joke? But everyone goes, Edinburgh. I, pro I don't even, e Edinburgh? That's how I would say it, Edinburgh. Yeah, Edinburgh. But he did, I'm off of what I get. He does, there's a guy who's like, what's up, TikTok? I'm here in Edinburgh. <laughs> and then his mate's like, says something incredibly unmonetizable in a Scottish accent. Mm. It's Edinburgh. Yeah. yeah. It's, anyway, anyway. Sorry, I've got very distracted by you calling him Bellingham. Yeah, right. Um, what formation you want? <laughs> Do you know what? He might have intercept plus. I'm actually going to play him, Cam. I'm going to play 4 2 3 1, the second variation. Okay. You're good. He can't play CDM. How can he. He's. Oh, I don't know. Why is he a Cam? Why is he got intercept plus? Just to give him a different play style plus, I guess, from his one with technical plus and his one with relentless plus. But there we go. This, this playstyle, by the way, is actually really good. I have an Evo James Garner with it, and he's class. And I used to play, when I was being stupid, with the little indicators on above their head. That uh -huh. makes the game lag, but also tells you when your players do doing playstyle pluses. And it, it used to pop up loads, and it used to make some ridiculous... Oh, he still does make some ridiculous interceptions, but it'd pop up and be like, that's because of intercept plus, that's because of intercept plus. And I'm like, but yeah, this thing's insane. I need to get this on more players, but maybe not on my cam. Anyway, anyway... Okay. Before we go off on another one, and we get shouted out by the comment section, because it takes 20 minutes to pick our first players, shall we jump in and do some guesses? Yes, where you want to start? Striker left mid, right mid, and two strikers left wing, right wing. All right, into the first picks we go. 
Christmas jumpers, by the way, are still available. Obviously, if you order one now, I can almost guarantee that it won't be delivered for Christmas. It's the 21st. You could gamble if you really wanted to. But it's probably... You got the 22nd, 23rd, 24th. And the Christmas post is going to be rammed. So I think, technically, it's two to three days delivery, but... You can have it for next year, and that's what's important. You can have it for next year, or you can wear it on box. Well, I guess the postman's not going to deliver it on Christmas Day, is he? You can wear it on New Year's Day. I don't know. But if you want to support the channel and you want to support the charity, link is down in the description. We've obviously got the two of them. We've got a bundle on the go as well, which has been added, which I'm, I've told you about previously. It's all good. Oh, something else. Right, obviously, I'm going to ruin the magic. It's not currently the 21st of December when I'm recording this video. However, one of the videos that has gone up somewhat recently, and this is the next one I'm filming, is Day 14 against Ginge. Interesting. Ginge didn't edit the pub quiz question in. So, it doesn't matter because in order to know the answer to the pub quiz questions, you've got to watch all of the videos anyway. So I'm going to tell you now what Day 14's pub quiz question was. And I'm going to double check to make sure I get it right because I've got a note of all of them. What was the Bournemouth versus Man United score this season? that Ginge went to after recording day 13. I know it. As easy as that. Very nice. Don't tell the people the answer. They're going to go, well, it's not a very hard question. You can tell the people the answer if you want. No, 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 we won't. But let's just be honest. It's United, so you're starting with an L. Yeah. <laughs> people also keep asking me, right, I need to make the Google form, the Google Sheets, whatever it's called, for this pub quiz question. I don't know if I've covered this in a video or just spoke about it on stream, so I'll quickly tell you now. When I initially started this, in my head, it was mm -hmm. a system where you had to fill in all the answers correct in order mm -hmm. for it to share your email with me to be entered into the giveaway. I think most people are going to get all of the questions right. And rather than coding that and somebody making a little spell mistake or putting the score in the wrong way around or something like that, I think what I'll do is just everybody who enters it, it will tell me your email and I'll randomly draw somebody and then I'll then check your answers because I'm pretty sure most people are going to get it right. And all of that effort to make sure you have to type the right answers in is probably wasted effort because it's much less effort to just check two or three people's answers because mm. most it's not going to take more than like two people for somebody to get all of the answers right because like the questions aren't actually that hard. Yeah. So rather than stressing about typing Jotter improperly or using the, the score in the right order, where should I, oh my God, should I write 2-5 or should I write 5-2? It, it doesn't matter. Don't worry. Just... Type your answers in, and I'll make sure that you've got the questions right before emailing you and asking you, would you like an Amazon card, a PlayStation card, or an Xbox card, or something like that, and hook you up for Christmas. So, the form is to come. Don't worry about your answers too much. Obviously, they have to be correct and make sense, but you're not going to get scammed because you didn't put, like, a little Portuguese A over Jota instead of an English A. Or, like, the little... Do you know what it's called, skills? The little line? Nope, I have no idea. No? Inflection? No. I don't know. Anyway, don't worry. It's fine. Don't stress. What Skills needs to stress about is who he's putting in his team. Me first or you first? Go on, tell me you want. You've got four players, Skills. All right, here we go. At the left wing position, I would like to have the best in the name goes by the name of Mbappe. All right, all right, all right, all right. At the other striker position... <laughs> What? Let's just let's just stop. What? Let's analyze what's just happened here. I felt that it, this is. Listen, when you show up to squad build, when you show up to this, you got squad build showdown. You show up and, and you let it all hang out, and you go for it, bro. You show you got you got to go for it, lad. You're lucky I didn't put R nine. I thought about it, but I said oh you know what. God's going not, outside, not this man. year. Not this year. You know, I'm not going to do it this year. Next up, I would like to keep it at PSG. I don't know how to say the name properly. I think it's Kat Katutu. Kat Katoto. Then, you know, I think we should probably keep it still with PSG. You know what I mean? Might as well put a PSG team together. Go with my boy Colo. Okay. A little Colo action. Always nice to have a little colo action, okay? And then at the right wing position, you know, because you need that Jude Bellingham chemistry. Surely you wrote this down, but I'm hoping that it was so obvious that you didn't write it down. I want Rodrigo. How many oh did you get? God. How many did you I, get? Oh my God. Is this a troll? No, how many did you get, dude? Tell me right now, bro. I wrote Griezmann. Ooh. That's a good one. Depay. Okay. Rashford. Ooh. 
and Sterling. Let's go! I <laughs> forgot that you're mental. You're in the Bateson club. Oh, no, nah, no. Nah, dude, it's not even that good of a team. It's just Mbappe. It's not even that good of a team. Nah. Which, which Mbappe have you got? The Red 92. The player of the month. Oh, I made him right. Oh, my God. You're a, you're a, oh, my God. <laughs> and I'm going to guess yours. Let me put mine up. Go on. Why? What is it with this series and just people bullying me? We've had Tex. We've had Orzio. We've had Run the Foot Market. We've had Bateson. Now we've got you dropping 20 and O's and then building that. Hey, listen. It's going to be okay. I believe. Do you still get 20 and O's every week, Skills? 19 and ones, bro. Like, I'm, I just, I lost the 18 and 0 last weekend. I just, I, the 19 and one, it just, I don't know. I just can't get the 20, bro. But 19 and one, it's all right, I guess. It's pretty good. Could be better. But it's pretty I, good. I this wish is, I got 20. This, this is, this is Stolzio, right? Orzio. Plays to 19 and then gives away a free win. He's so good, that guy. He's just so good. Nah, he's not so good. He, but he knows you're playing to 19 and then trying to get 20 and losing. And then everyone goes, oh, I bottled the 20. <sighs> Whereas he plays to 19 and goes, don't worry, guys. I would have won that one as well and gives a free win. <sighs> no, you wouldn't, Ozio. You little 19 win fraud. Uh, 90, he's also a 19 and one fraud. He's playing mind games, mate. Make yeah. him play the last game. Watch him lose. Yeah, I agree. I it's, agree. Maybe that's what you should do. You should get to your 19 wins and go, oh, guys, I would have won the last one as well. I've won 19 in a row. Let's just give somebody a free win. I'm such a nice guy. Whereas actually, you just hide in the bottle. I lost at 18. I wanted to start the video and go, hey, guys, guess what, man? I wanted to lose the game so I could make the last one really challenging. <laughs> but then I was like, they're just <laughs> never going to believe that. <laughs> for the content. <laughs> yeah, I did it for the content, dude. I did it for the content. Chow, give me your picks. I know I got one. Okay. You know you've got one. I know it. Do you remember the name? What do you mean? Wayne Rooney! I was gonna put Wayne Rooney, I swear to you I was. Can I tell you who I put instead of Wayne Rooney? Well, let me tell you who the players first in case they can also play left or right mid and then you can. All right, I'm going. I mean, there's not a chance you've guessed them. I'm going to the Liga F. So F in the chat for skills, basically, for guessing my players. I'll have at right mid, Anthenia, and okay. at left mid, Salma Paloluelo. Mmm. So, I mean, you can't tell me who you put instead of Rooney because there's no way you put that. Okay, so I threw Rashford at left mid. That's the obvious one, right? Yeah. And then instead, I, I figured you weren't going to go with Wayne and you would go with Smith because she's still an Ooh, English icon. Did you actually put an, an English icon? Oh yes, my God. Yes, I went Smith. But then I was like, oh, he might not take that. So it's Mick Manaman. <laughs> Nice. Okay. You like the way nice. I said that? McMahon, man. That's, that's how he speaks, isn't it? His commentary really winds me up. Because I've said this before in Scrub the Show. He's Scouse, but you can tell he's done elocution lessons to be on the telly. Mm. So he'll say something dead Scouse, but it'll be, and then end by really enunciating a single word. Uh huh. So he'd be like, I'm such a big fan of Drew Bellingham. He's going to go so far in the game. He's got incredible shooting. He's got incredible dribbling. And he's got really good passing. And it's just the way he says passing. After yeah. he said shooting and dribbling, it just really grates on me. It gets but, to you. I, I mean, yeah, I don't mind like his insights and what he actually says. I just wish he'd just accept the fact that he doesn't sound like the queen and just roll with it and just commentate normally. And rather than pronouncing one word really good at the end, it, yeah. uh, it just really winds me up. But I picked, do you want to know why I picked Wayne Rooney? Tell me. I played against Run the Foot Market. Okay. And he picked Balak mm -hmm. and scored some ridiculous goals with Power Shot Plus, which I didn't realize was as OP as it is. I've got Rooney on my road to glory and went into for champs qualies and scored some stupid goals of it. If you could teach me a little summon summon to turn me into a 14 or 16 wins for champs player, that would be very much appreciated, mate. I'm going to show you how to, I'm going to show you how to be a rat. I think what you're going to teach me is how to use your credit cards based on your team. Whoa, whoa, my 19 and ones are only on Road of Glories. I don't play the big account. The big account is just <laughs> open packs. I don't play this account, all right? I swear. Matter of fact, the RT, what I did on this account today was the best in present, best in present, past and present Real Madrid team, okay? So I don't, I don't, I, I only, only the Road of Glory I take seriously. Okay. Oh, see, this is how you get to skills. Tilt them, get under his skin. No, 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 I was just kidding. I was just kidding. <laughs> no, I was kidding. <laughs> oh, only no. got through on goal there because you could have carded your skills. <laughs> nah, 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 nah. How many midfielders do I have to guess for you? 
two CDMs, mate, and I'll get you all one sentiment. Let's move on. All right, all right, I got this. Okay, into the midfield we go. I'm going to go first. Okay. Because it scares me, to be honest with you. There is an alarm. Like most of the centre mids, does nobody in La Liga play with the CDM? Because if mm. I whack this onto... I mean, there is obviously actual CDMs, like too many and stuff. But mm. if I put this on La Liga mm. and search centre mids, I'm really struggling to find La Liga. There it is. And we look at the cards, like Valverde can't play CDM, Modric can't, Pedri can't, De Jong can't, Cruz can, Bellingham can't, Coquelin can't. In, like, in what world is Coquelin not a CDM? He's a really left mid and right mid. De Paul can't. The options are limited. So what I'm going to do is completely abandon that train of thought and go to the Premier League and get two English ones that will get me full chemistry. So... I would like somebody who I've been using quite a lot in this series and is really good because he's got Relentless Plus, Conor Gallagher, okay. Triple Threat. Okay. And I'll pair him up next to Drew Bellingham, not Drew Bellingham, Declan Rice, sorry. One of the other, along with Bellingham, is where my brain just went, incredibly good young English players. No! No! Dick's a few years older, but... No! Both. I'm going to explain why I'm saying no. Okay. My first write-down was Rice. And my second write down was Connor, but I changed it for Palinga because I thought you would go Palinga into Juwon into Juwon Cancelo in the back. I had both of them written down, bro, and I changed one. No, so you still got one. I got Rice. I would have had both oh, of them. I would have had the double go. whammy, bro. I knew you weren't going to go La Liga because there's no DMs there. So I said, you always 100% switching Premier League. But I thought you would go Palinga to get Juwon Cancelo in your team because the bars are linked to that girl on the left. Darn it, man. I would have had it, bro. Oh, I should have went Calvin Phillips to support that dusty ball of techs. Oh, man. That's crazy. At least I got one, though. Nice. You got Conor Gallagher. No, I got Rice, but I had Conor written, oh, okay, and okay. I changed it at the end for Polina. Still a good hit. I've lost a player when I thought I was doing something sneaky. and not so Somebody commented in my chat saying, are you broke? And the, the answer is yes. Yes, because I've spent about two mil on Bellingham and Rooney. And that's basically all my coins. So yes, I am. Thanks for thanks for reminding me. I feel like today all I'm remembering is memes. Have you seen that kid's doing his math zone work? I don't think I've seen it. Jaden has one dollar, two quarters, and a five dollar note. How much money does Jaden have? Jaden broke. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I haven't seen it, but I want to see that one. <laughs> that one's funny. Oh, oh, this this is bad. Are we putting are we putting a goalie here for you? Oh, if we must. Um, I think we should go with. Uh, I was gonna say Tom Heaton. He's a silver, but nah, we should go worse than that, shouldn't we? What do you think? <laughs> I think, I think rice. I think it's Christmas. I think we should go with. Alex, no, 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 no. Brandon Austin from Spurs. Austin from Spurs. 64 goalkeeper, bronze. Is that fine? Is that cheating? That is not cheating. That is just terrible for me. Thanks, mate. No problem. He has good passing. <sighs> Who do you want? Uh, 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 I would like to have, if you don't mind, um... Frankie de Jong. I thought I was so smart. I thought I was so smart. Oh, who'd you write? I wrote Zidane. That was a good one because I was going to put him. And that, because they would have linked Mbappe, I would have done it. Dude, I've been doing like, I've got the microphone in my mouth, dog. And I've got like a past and present Real Madrid team, dude. <laughs> yeah, probably shouldn't have said that. <laughs> so I was like, I'm on to him. I remembered past and present Real Madrid. Zidane, he must have it in the club. He's got French players. You put Zidane in and that gets you to five French. That gives them more chemistry. Mm. It gets linked. Oh, mm, mm, I thought mm. I was so smart. And then you've just picked Frankie de Jong, who's an absolute pain in the ass. I think I think you'll get me on defense, honestly. I, I <sighs> feel it. I feel you getting me on defense. I am so sad. I am about to get absolutely pummeled. Let's move into the fullbacks. Right. 
into the fullbacks. Your team terrifies me. I mean, you still do need to get chemistry for it, but it's not that difficult with mm. an icon. Mm. It's just when you're going to whip the icon out is the problem. Mm. Mm -hmm. when, when are you going to whip the icon out, Skills? Is it now or is it in the next section? The final section? Is that my cue to go? That is your cue to go. At left back, I would like... Uh, I'm going to throw you a little curveball. There's no way you got this. I want Luke Shaw. And at right back, I would like, I think you get this. I legitimately think you get this. I would like Inform Arrojo from Barcelona. You got that. I know you got that. I was going to write down two Barca fullbacks. Mm. But I didn't want to write, I, was, I put Cancelo for right back and I didn't want to put Alex Balde. Okay. Because he's just not that good and you've got Mbappe in your team, you know? So you win a rojo. And then you said, Luke Shaw. <laughs> Sorry, have you evoed him? <laughs> no, I'm just going to... No! Just gonna, what do you do? I listen, I, I do road to glories, man, like Luke Shaw, you know? Why not? How am I meant to guess Luke Shaw? <laughs> but you guessed a rojo, didn't you? No, I put Cancelo and Mendy. Oh, let's go. I'm good. Yes. Yes. And the great thing about it is I'm going to get yours. Let's hear him. I need chemistry for Salma. Mm-hmm. Now, I can get chemistry for it with a couple of Liga F players. You could. I can get chemistry for it with a Barcelona player. You could. I can get chemistry for it with Spanish players. That's true. I don't know what the least bait thing is. I'm torn. I might just pick a Barca player. Okay. Just to get it out the way, to be honest with you. And let me do something else on the other picks. So, I, I looked at picking Gaia and then DeMarcos. And that just puts me into the same hole I've been in in other Swabler Showdowns. Where I have to pick a Spanish person at the final section. And there's not that many good ones. I'm going to go Alex Balde and just hope you haven't written it down. I really wanted Olga Carmona, the Real Madrid women's left back, but it still wouldn't give Salma full chem. So I was going to go here and Lucy Bronze to get full chemistry. I was going to go here and Sheila or something, but we'll go Alex Balde, which gives everyone full chemistry. And then I can pick kind of who I want on the other side. So I'll go for a man with my favorite play style. Inform Trent. My first pick was Olga. Yes! My second pick was Carvajal. Come on! You're safe. You're safe. Woo, baby. Okay, that's one. I, I was no, I was about to slander you. I'd say we've both lost the player because I've lost my CDM and you've lost your left back. But actually, I picked Balde as well, so I can't really talk. I mean, he has got 14 more pace than Luke Shaw. Ah. But he's 81 rated. So I'm just going to say nothing and move on to the centre-backs and goalie. All right. You, my friend, have got far too good at this game. This is only like your third squad of the showdown ever, but the difference from the first one is troubling. That you've always been very good at the gameplay. But take me back to skills who didn't even know how chemistry works and I just guessed all the players. What you don't know is maybe I'm a super fan and I've been Ooh, studying. Been studying? You know? Listen, you never know. You never know. That's scary. Okay, mm. so that does worry me for my last picks. Before we do that then, who do you want? You need to sort your chemistry out, mate, and I'm very intrigued as to how you're going to do it. I did this for the boys because I thought the boys would like it. And I, I feel deep down inside that you got it right, you got me. You keep saying that, and I just don't. Harry Maguire. Okay, I feel you wrote that, but I did it for the boys, man. I thought it would be entertaining, okay? Harry Maguire. Then I decided I needed an icon, right? And I thought you would get Blanc, so I decided let me go with Maldini, right? You're trolling me. The one I put in, taking the mick when I was planning what guesses, was Maldini. But I thought, that's stupid to guess an icon, so I'm not going to do that. There's so many. It could be any of them. Oh my god. And then okay. I still need a little bit of chem, so I'm gonna go with Donna Ruma where I'm sure you got that one right. Let's hear it. You got all three? You got the double whammy? 
because you're quiet. And every time you're quiet, I've been here many times, bro. You got me. So go on and say it. Which one? Does that get Luke Shaw full chemistry? Yeah. Oh, it does because player. The oh, perfect link from Maguire. Player of the month. Oh, I didn't. Okay. That's so annoying. Am I good? I didn't. I didn't bother writing down an icon because I thought it was just a waste of a guess. It's just funny that when I was like putting your squad into footbin to represent the icon, I typed in Maldini. So I had Blanc because I wanted Blanc, but then when you said, oh, an icon gets you full cam, I figured you would go French. So I was like, let me okay. go to Maldini. Oh man, that could have been bad. But surely you got Donnarumma. No, I put Pope because English and the new card. So I'm good? I put Varane because French Man United. <sighs> and you put? Play them with Harry Maguire. Get them out of your squads. Come I on. Knew it, bro, why you do that? Harry Maguire would have been for the boys. <laughs> I tell you what, then. I tell you what. Tell me. We could still have Harry Maguire in this video. I don't want Maldini. Nah, I'm I'll, I'll stay with Maldini. I'm good. You're going to try to switch me Maldini. No, I'm going to have play them with Harry Maguire. So, oh, you got him. No, no, no. You're oh. getting a, no, 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 no. You're getting a goalie. <laughs> I thought you were being but nice. I'm having play them oh, with Harry Maguire. Okay, 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 okay. Harry Maguire, okay. I was scared that you've become a squabble of the showdown super fan and would be writing down Schlotterbeck and Hummels or Kalulu and Mignon or Kalulu and Giroud or there's Castiles and Bornau or the perfect links, basically. Yeah. So for I just go to the Prem. Back okay. to the Prem. Okay. And I'll have Maguire, Thunderstruck Romero and Emmy Martinez. So I went Kempembe and Lucas Hernandez for the double link, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then I threw Ali's son in net because I thought you would go back Ooh. to the Prem. Okay, so we're back to Prem, guys. You've been, you have been uh, studying. Listen, I'm telling you. Uh, who do you want me to put in at my center back position? Let me find you someone beautiful. Mm. You can have, I'm going to give you a Wrexham goalie who's called McNicholas. It's Irish Santa Claus. Mick Nicholas. Mick Nicholas. So M C N. Where's this guy even at, bro? Oh, I found him. Luke Mick. Is it Luke? It is. Luke Mick Nicholas, mate. Yeah. Irish Santa Claus. What are we doing, bro? Coming down your chimney, so he is. Goalkeeper, sixty-two pace. I hope he's not on the market. So you have to give me somebody else. He's on the market. <laughs> Damn it, man. Okay. Let me get Austin in for Rice. You get Mick Nicholas in for Big Harry. Okay. And let's jump into a game. I'm excited. All right, skills, into the game we go. Uh, I'm nervous. Same. We've already covered as well day 14 for the question. Fix that. We need to do day 21. So the question for today's pub quiz for day 21 is, what is the best Star Wars film? Mm. Good luck, Mr. Skills. Good luck to you and... This ping is horrendous. Just, uh, yeah, that's my excuse, all right? Oh, look at my goalie center back. What a guy. It's McNicholas. Santa Claus. What a guy. Coming down your chimney, so I am. We just got to cook with this guy the whole game. Just stay on him the whole time, bro. Oh, we have a chance. Oh, it was going to be for Big Jude. Wayne against Maldini. Who gets the better? It's okay. A roll. Oh! No! This game trolls, bro. No! You didn't even pass it there, bro. What am I seeing? You tackled it to me. That is crazy. What have we witnessed? Offside, ref. This is ridiculous. Oh. Hey, I can't pass because the ping, bro. The chance. Oh, no. Trent's playing. Nah, Harry Maguire, mate. What a man. And he hits <laughs> the ball roll. Let's <laughs> go another way. There's no way. Harry Maguire can't be stopped. Not even Maldini can stop him. Not even Maldini can stop him. There's no way. No! Donnarumma! Come on, Donnarumma. Come on, lad. Big lad. Big lad, Donnarumma, bro. Oh, Skills knows the ratty tactics. Oh, we no. it anyway. There's no way. Let's go! It's not aimed over there. On for sure. No! There's no oh, way! Oh, there's oh, no oh, way! Oh, Bro, there's no way! It's gonna fall! 
What am I see? This game is trolling! <laughs> Mate, it really wants me to score. We're fine, we're fine. Ref, yes, no! ref! Come on, 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 ref! <laughs> oh, man. Look at that. Offside. That's totally on. That was clean. <gasps> Come on, goalie! Oh, God, my God. God. Yo, Santa Claus is crazy! Santa Claus is crazy! McNicholas! Travella? It's it! Oh yes, boys! Go on, lads! No! Yes! War a hit! Oh, my day, Santa Claus is cooked. Oh, no! No! no. 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 Yeah. Why is this Tommy Roma? You love it. You love to see it, dude. No way. Oh, we love you it. You got it. We you yes, we love those. We love those, big dude. Love this, too. Turn. Pen! Come on, ref! Come on, you big ref! Ref, you're the man. You're the man, ref. I want you to know you're the man. Oh, God, the ping, though. Jude Bellingham! He's him! It's Big Jude! Thanks for picking Big Jude as our player, bro. I, you're the oh man. Oh, my God. He's going to cost me 1.2 mil. Come on. No. No! Shit! No, Santa oh, Claus! No, Santa Claus, you're mudded, you're mudded, you're mudded. The worst part is that was 100% going in. Ah, yeah, go, okay, go, okay. go, 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 go. It's gone in anyway. That, yeah. that Traveller from Rooney just hits different. It was 100% going in, and then there was a chance you were going to save it. <laughs> but it's in. <laughs> I can't, I can't left stick, bro. The, the, the connection's too heavy. Dibape, come on, do your magic, bro. Pen! Yeah, I said it. I wanted a pen. <laughs> <laughs> Back post. Please be there. Haro, no! Haro, oh, dude. That's a 50p head. No. Yes! Come on! She's cooking! I didn't even know she was good. I didn't even know this girl was good. But she's amazing. She's the one. Timothy. Oh, her oh that's, that's such a cheese pass, you know. Good. Oh, piss on Maldini. <laughs> no. When in doubt, take him out. I missed. No. Ah, oh, great finish, you know. Great okay, finish. Yo, okay, you're actually, okay. you're, you're, doing, you're doing Santa Claus dirty, man. You're going on the naughty list. We cover these. No, we don't. Yes, we do. No, we don't. That's... D oh, my God. You failed to tackle me twice. And he's... Oh, oh my God! God this game God. sucks! Offside. Ref! No way. That's surely offside in every world. That's just offside, isn't it? Remember the name! Oh, my gosh, bro. Come on. We go again. We go again. We go again! We do go again. This could be the end. Oh, it's Austin! Why have I passed it to Austin? Passed it to Austin again. I've passed it to Austin again. Oh, I you can't pass it up. to Austin. Oh, I was oh. rushing because of this 90 second minute. Just a bit of composure, Andy, and you could have won the game. Ah, what did I just see? Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It is a discard, a piece. Oh, we both discard? One each. Oof. So I didn't, what I did then was very unchristmassy. I didn't save myself a discard. I just gave you one. Mm -mm -mm. Are you ready? Yes, I've mixed my team around. Four, two, three, one. The second variation. Pick a position. Right center back. It's an SPC, but it doesn't cost millions of coins. Could you lose? It's Christian Romero, Thunderstruck. Okay. That was his debut for the club. And he's gone. Thank you for your service, Romero. Wait, 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 wait. I've got a Discord at your play the month in Bappe. Yeah. Oh my god. What for 424? Four, four. Yeah. I'm nervous. Right wing. Oh my god, dude. Frankie Diong left wing. Mbappe left mid. 
I mean, left center mid, but I kept Rodrigo at right wing, dude. I lose gold oh, Rodrigo. Oh, gold Rodrigo as well. Yeah. Snake. So wait, do I just discard him? Or I got to put him in SPC. We'll go put them in an SPC. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. There we are then. SPC Romero goes into an SPC, unfortunately. Mm. But it's better than discarding 1.2 mil. So I'll call that a small dub. And if we can get something from this 85 plus player pick. Imagine. When you open your imagine. countdown, I'd do the same one. Imagine. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Never mind. What'd you get? Did you, have you done one as well? I, I got Tony yeah. Cruz's normal cards. Oh, I got Harry K90. It's good father. Good father. Thanks very much for watching. We'll see you tomorrow on Skills Channel.